Okay, so again, welcome back mga ka rider. So, nakikita nyo ngayon is ang isa sa mga, well, bagong progress key. Nung nilabas ito. <laughs> so, since late na ako nagre-reviews, uh, may ba naman? So, today we are reviewing the first and second main upgrade ni Zero One. Ba at second, well, of course, dahil nakikita niyo naman may attachment. <laughs> So, the first upgrade of Zero One was is basically Shining Hopper. So, the first one we're gonna do is the DX Shining Hopper Progress Key. So, of course, nakaran siya ng para mga blades sa na shoulders and naging karan siya ng abs. Uh, so, makikita niyo ito na ka abs si Zero One. So. <laughs> So, move the, moving the box aside. Okay, so, like any most progress keys, this is different. Because this is casted in transparent or translucent. Transparent plastic. Green one, to be precise. So, although this is actually called shining, this is, for me, this is actually a letdown. Because it doesn't really light up. Which Bandai would actually make another version of this, which at this actually lights up. But further, this is actually the first upgrade, so it's forgivable in the man. So, unlike the other progress keys, this actually has gold plated, like the others. All you need about is basically just colored. Ito is gold, it's gold plated. So, opening the key, which is actually pretty clever, makes makes a grasshopper, a big one. Then, ito yung, lo ito yung, yung rider logo ni... Yeah. So, closing the key and pressing the button. Shining jump! Shining jump. Hindi na po siya jump. So, since shining hopper, shining siya. So, uh, again. Shining hopper's ability! Okay. So, yon. So let's try it. So zero one driver, which is I'm turning gonna turn on. Zero one driver. Let's try it. Shining jump. Authorized. Again, all the way push tension. So, may bago tayong phrase. So, like most of the upgrade progress keys, they have their own individual unique phrases. So, this one is basically that. So, for hen so for finisher, press it again. Okay, so, medyo, medyo mas okay yung kanyang finisher. If you're done, we're going to get it out. Okay, so, in any reviewer's rules, I'm done. Pero, since you have seen this one, we're not. <laughs> so, what this is, is the DX Assault Grip. Um, this usually normally comes with the DX Assault Wolf, which I will review next time, or indefinitely, depende. <laughs> Once we tackle Vulcan's gear, then yun, you'll see that. So this piece of plastic, basically, is just a plastic. It actually just basically pushes a button, although this looks like the hazard trigger. Or a Zodiart switch, which is a good thing. Yeah, it does remind me of the Zodiart switch, the horoscope one. Once you color this red, it looks like that. So again, what this does is it activates a special mode in this in the, in the progress key to actually make it a new one 
Good job, Bandai. Making a progress key has its, have its own two upgrades in one. So this is actually one of the first time they actually did this. So again, pushing in. So it changes the dynamic look. It now has basically a grip with a button on it. So in, instead of Eton pe press natin, we're going to press this one because of course, of course, let's make it official. So pressing this is Ooh, hyper jump. Ayos. So again. Alright, so what this form is going to going to initiate is the shining assault form, which is shining assault hopper. Basically this form combines the power of Zeya and the Arc satellites into one form. This is basically an upgrade for an upgrade. Just like Deep Spectre, if you know what that is. So again, it actually makes the key longer. A tad bit longer well again said and done let's do it let's put in the belt oh yeah you're gonna have used two hands for this it's so long <laughs> okay let's do this yep I'm gonna scan it kahit nakalabas yeah, I can do that over rice so hindi na siya progress, overrise na siya. Meaning, it's upgraded. So again, you put it in the side, and press it up to the dulo. Henshin! Okay, so medyo mas dumagdag ang phrases at mas naging exciting. So, napansin niyo guys, para may ano no, para may warning sound dun sa dumpisa. Which is a feature that I really really like. It sounded like a nuclear power plant basically warning you to get out of the facility. Cuz basically this form should is basically one of Zero One's most powerful early forms in in his mid episodes. Well, in yet. <laughs> well, of course. So again. But this time, we're doing the finisher. It's kind of different. Since we have a separate button, nandito sa dula ng progress, we press that. And it'll initiate something special. A separate charge. Now, this is very different. It beats. It changes the dynamic look of the whole belt. So again, press it again for finishing. Okay. So with that being said, I think we're done. But wait. Is there more? Nah. I'm just joking, it's done. <laughs> so like the other review, I won't actually do the upgrade charges because it's the same thing as the first review. And uh, I don't want, yeah, I'm actually sick and tired of that. So basically, to, to detransform. Yeah, note to self, fully push this because basically it'll can re it can release a progress key, but it won't, the sound won't. Do it. So once released, then doing it. So basically, that's it. So my guys, kung na aliw, kung kayo ay nananod ng mga reviews ko, well, people are gonna ask me, nasan yung iba na progress keys? Don't worry, they will have their own videos. And of course, eto lang mo na yung mga papalabas ko. So again, guys, thank you for tuning in sa akin channel and thank you please like share and subscribe and like i always say this is justin and just by dx